What's up guys and girls, DC One Worlds Gaming here and today I'm bringing you a video on how to set up your Apple Pay. Uh, Apple Pay is only going to work in the US for the moment and you do need to have an iPhone 6 or an iPhone 6 Plus. Also make sure you have iOS 8.1 installed on your device, either a 6 or a 6 Plus like I said. So the first thing you actually have to do is you have to find the application that's called Passbook. What you do is you just go ahead and tap on Passbook. Uh, this application is usually there in front of your, pretty much on your home screen. It might be in a different folder, so just make sure you look there for something that says Passbook. Once you do that, you're going to see the options there. Credit cards and debit cards, pay with Touch ID. That's pretty much what you're going to tap on, set up Apple Pay. And it's going to pretty start loading there. Um, with this here, pretty self-explanatory there add a new credit card or a debit card. And if you want to learn a little, a little bit more about what Apple Pay is, you can go ahead and select that and it will take you to the Apple website. Now with this here, you're just pretty much going to tap add a new credit card. And once you tap on add a new credit card, it's going to bring you to the card details. So for this, what you can put there is just put the name of the card. Just make sure you have everything set up right. Then you'll scroll down. You can add the credit card number yourself and you can tap on this little icon right here and it'll pretty much you put the what you will do is once you tap on that you'll have to make sure that the car is set up within that rectangle and it will actually read all the information there from that car or at least as much as it can then it will auto populate there your car number once you actually have all that information there filled out what it will do next is it will start contacting your bank to make sure you're able to actually set up this credit card and be able to pay with Apple Pay. So now I'm gonna show you guys what happens after you enter that information, okay? So after you do that, it's just gonna start verifying the card there. Um, pretty much by storing your credit card, it will tell you that information there. You can either agree or disagree to it. Obviously, if you disagree to it, you're not gonna be able to use it. Uh, once you agree to it, then you will pretty much ask again, do you want to agree to it? And then you say yes, it will start actually fully verifying the card there. Uh, right now, what it's pretty much doing is contacting the bank. And as you can see there, now that the card is pretty much activated, what it will do is it will show the card there. Um, if it's a Bank of America car, obviously it will show it pretty much exactly how it is there. Uh, and as you can see there, my Visa card is already ready to be used for Apple Pay. So that's pretty much it. So obviously what you want to do if you want to add another card, you would just pretty much tap on the plus icon and then tap right there where it says add another card. Once again, don't remember, remember guys, to do this, you do need iOS 8.1 and you need to find the application that is called Passbook. That application already comes installed with your iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 Plus. And hopefully what I think is going to be cool is if Apple makes this available for the iPad Air and the iPad Mini 3. Since they are going to have Touch ID, but I'm not sure if they'll have the chip that enables them to use uh, Apple Pay. So maybe in the future, that'll be a neat feature. So just remember, Passbook, once you set up your car, or if you're going to set up a car, just select there, add another car. If you're going to set up another car, and then once you click on Done, you just pretty much do this. And then if you're going to pay, I'm actually going to post in out of a video here of me actually paying something with Apple Pay, just so you guys can kind of see the process of that. I will put the link in the link for that video in the description. So just keep an eye out for that. If you guys want to see anything else here, just comment something. Uh, if you guys want to see more content, subscribe, like this video. That way, at least I know it's helping people out. And if you have any questions, just post them down in the comments. I'll make sure to answer all of them. All right. Have a good one, guys. Take care.